Once a year, scholars and theologians gather in Rome's Pontifical University of St. Thomas Aquinas to discuss new approaches of interreligious understanding between all faiths. Professor David Ford from Cambridge University spoke to the group about the meetings he holds between Jews, Muslims, and Christians to sit down with each other and study the scriptures of each religion. When you study in depth, year after year, with Jews and Muslims, then you get a completely different understanding of the richness, the variety, the arguments going on in those traditions. Uh, you know, and you, it's far less easy to generalize and say, I know what Islam is, I know what Judaism is. Professor Ford has said that these kind of interreligious sit-downs can help people to better understand their own faith when seen through the eyes of others. It's something that he believes is for the common good and has led to improved relations between the three Abrahamic faiths. There's things like the follow through to a common word or to Debruemet, the, you know, the Jewish um, statement in relation to Christianity. And a common word was the Muslim letter from 138 Muslim leaders to Christians. And in the follow up to all of those, there has been the need for Jews and Christians, Christians and Muslims to engage in study of their scriptures uh, together. The annual lecture has been named after John Paul II and his efforts to promote interfaith understanding. The late Pope was someone that Professor Ford says greatly improved relations with other religions, even though the moves were sometimes seen as controversial in and outside of the Vatican. He also, of course, visited a synagogue for the first time here in Rome. And that was an astonishing thing to do. And of course, he also, at the, near the end of his life, he visited Israel for that extraordinarily moving event. And he took initiatives, you know, towards a range of other religious traditions as well. And I think overall, I mean, he must go down in history as, you know, one of the greatest popes. By inviting scholars with a knowledge of various religions, the University of St. Thomas Aquinas hopes to build new bridges between the religious of tomorrow's generation.